Okay, so to keep the line that I want to use on my ring saw, I'm going to add a little bit of Vaseline to cover it. Okay, so with the pressed flour um, pieces here, I recommend that we wipe them off first and allow them to sit and, and dry. This is alcohol, by the way. You want to get them really clean and you don't want any moisture in there when you put your flowers in there and press it together. And when you're soldering the edge, I don't recommend liquid flux at all. Uh, you don't want anything to get in between the, the foil and the pieces of glass. So I'm just going to wipe that off and have a look and make sure that it's absolutely clean and free of streaks. Okay, so I really um, like the placement of these flowers. And I kind of do that. I play around with it first and see how I like it. And then I'm going to go ahead and um, just put the teeniest dot of glue. I use a clear glue. This is Fabri-Tac glue. Just the teeniest little dot just to hold it in place. No need to get crazy. Just the smallest little dot. Like I said, it's just the smallest little bit. Just a little sticky to hold it down. I don't want too much on there. It's hard with the gloves if I shouldn't have these on right now. is going to go over that and then we're going to tape it together. Okay so my pieces are nice and dry now. They've been sitting for a while and I'm going to go ahead and foil them. The Edco, that's what this is. Find that on my website if you're interested. I'm going to have something to push in that corner. And I'll probably come back and put a little piece in there like this. And then I'll come back with my exacto knife and cut that. Like I said, my eyes are here. Not what it used to be. Okay. So this is the front. This is the back. 